The big question for a president in his final two years is how can he stay out of that lame duck status? Here's the president's approval rating in our brand new poll this morning. The president's at 47% approval, 51% disapproved. That's about static uh, from last month, 45% a year ago, I'm sorry, 45%, 50% a year ago. I want to get into the economic numbers too because this is what's interesting. The president's sort of holding steady. Those aren't horrible numbers. They're not great numbers. They're not horrible numbers. He's holding steady, but people are feeling better about the economy. That's usually the tide that lifts a president. Look at this. How do you feel about the economy? 36% a year ago felt good about the economy. Now, 48%, about half of the American people. And if you ask people, what do you think about a year from now? Look at that number. 56% say they think the economy is going to be better a year from now. And yet, how's the president handling the economy? 45% approved, 54% disapproved. Why isn't he getting personal credit for people's slowly increasing optimism about the economy? It really is curious that he's not getting credit because one of the reasons people are finally feeling the the effects of a better economy. Also, something like gas prices. That's every single day. You're going to the gas pump and you're not getting, um, you're, you're paying a decent amount for gas. So it really, it, you really have to wonder. I don't know the answer. Yeah, I can't, I don't have any data to back this up, but my gut tells me that the American public thinks that this is happening despite Obama and despite congressional leaders. They do feel the economy coming back. They do feel the impact at the gas prices. But we've seen in polls that their faith in government, their faith in their leaders has, you know, plummeted. Right. Um, so they don't see, you know, they see the president's not getting his agenda through. They see gridlock. They see petty bickering, you know, petty bickering and nothing getting done. So they kind of figure this is kind of happening on its own. I think also their faith in over the horizon. Uh, does, mm -hmm. do, do our leaders, Democrat right. or Republican, exactly. presidential or Congress, have an idea for what a 25-year plan, for what, the, what, what are we going to teach our kids, are they going to be ready for the economy, the American dream question we, we, down when, the road. when you're part of a system uh, that the public doesn't trust, it's, it's hard to expect right. uh, that your numbers are going to get any higher than where right. they are now.